What's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. If you're looking to pack on some serious muscle, you know that training hard and eating right are key, but supplements can give you that extra edge. In today's video, we're diving into the best supplements for muscle growth. These are the ones that actually work and are worth your money. Let's get into it. Many supplements in the market have very minimal effect regarding the building of muscles. However, these supplements below work. Number one, protein supplements. Muscle growth requires protein. Bodybuilding uses more protein than your body breaks down. Protein-rich foods can provide your protein needs. However, some people struggle. Then you should consider protein supplements. Protein supplements including whey, casein, egg, pea, rice, and soy are popular. Protein supplements are more effective than carbohydrates in promoting muscle growth in individuals who engage in physical activity. Adult men and women should consume animal, fish, and egg protein for muscle building and maintenance. For active muscle gain, 1.6 grams of protein per kilogram of body weight is recommended. Number two, creatine monohydrate. Your body needs more creatine as you gain muscle. Your body will consume several amino acids to meet this demand. Taking creatine monohydrate prevents your body from synthesizing creatine from amino acids. There will be enough amino acids to make new muscle fiber proteins. Creatine monophosphate supplements raise creatine phosphate by 40%. The small energy reserve provided by creatine lets you push harder during high intensity exercises like running and weightlifting. Micronized creatine monohydrate is the most potent form of creatine. The optimal dose is 5 grams. Number 3. Caffeine Caffeine is a stimulant which promotes strength, endurance, and weight loss by stimulating the production of adrenaline and dopamine. If you take caffeine frequently, then it loses most of its power-enhancing effects. Nevertheless, if you desire to consistently feel the benefits of increased power, I suggest restricting caffeine intake to a maximum of two occasions each week exclusively. For weight loss, consume about 100 to 200 milligrams and 500 milligrams for strength and endurance. Excessive caffeine will be detrimental to sleep quality and therefore your performance. Number four, beta alanine. Beta alanine is a lactic acid buffer that boosts training capacity, allowing you to train harder and longer. Weight training and athletic activities produce lactic acid. The large number of hydrogen ions produced lowers muscle pH and acidity. As muscle pH drops, peak performance diminishes. Beta alanine raises muscle's carnosine, which buffers hydrogen ions. Beta alanine, an antioxidant precursor, protects muscles against oxidative damage. Lean and muscular mass increase with beta alanine administration. Beta alanine supplement users perform better when they perform various workouts of three sets of 10 repetitions until muscular failure with 60 seconds of rest between sets and 120 seconds between exercises. The optimal dose for beta alanine is 6.4 grams per day, split into doses of 0.8 to 1.6 grams, taken every three to four hours to avoid paresthesia. Number five, nitrates. Nitrates can be obtained from natural sources, which include foods such as beetroot and leafy green vegetables. In our bodies, nitrates are broken down to form nitrites, which circulate in our system. Nitrites are converted by our bodies into nitric oxide, NO, when it is needed. Physically active people can benefit from high concentrations of NO, which promotes a variety of internal functions during exercise. Leafy green vegetables are an excellent natural source of nitrates, with rocket and lamb's lettuce providing more than 2.5 grams per kilo. To achieve the maximal ergogenetic effect, Consume up to 1,550 milligrams of nitrate two to 3.5 hours before exercise. And there you have it, the top supplements for muscle growth. These are the ones that have the science to back them up and can really help you make progress in the gym. Remember, 
Supplements should complement a solid diet and workout routine, not replace them. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and hit that subscribe button for more content like this. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.